Our first chestnut horse to see is a purebred Arabian gelding named J. Savo GRK. He's really flashy with that big blaze on his face and then the three white socks. And that mane and tail are so long and beautiful. J. Savo was sired by A. Jericho and the dam is Lady Justify GRK. The breeder is Gary R. Keel from Holiday, Utah. J. Savo is owned by Alaire Lewis, who is a good friend of Elizabeth DeSarle, who is the owner of the last horse I videoed. I'll put a link for that video at the end of this one, and you can see her gorgeous dapple gray stallion. He's really cool to watch. And speaking of cool, just look at the close-up of this guy. Pretty amazing. Here's a close-up of that mane that we took while we were getting him ready. And isn't that amazing? It looks like he went to the hairdresser and uh, had some highlights put in his mane. But I assure you, he did not. It's 100% natural. If you love horses and want to see more videos like this one, be sure to subscribe to my channel to be notified when more videos are published. And please share this video with any horse-loving friends you have who would love seeing it as well. That beautiful mountain range in the background is called Four Peaks. Pretty obvious how it got its name, but uh, at over 7,000 feet elevation, still had a little snow here just outside the Phoenix area. And back to the horse, I love watching him canter in slow motion. It's just really cool. And there the mane and tail are flying and really something to behold. And here's a good look at those flashy white socks he has. And then here you get a good look at that big wide white blaze on his face. I also like the black on his muzzle and his eye, around his eyes, uh, it really makes it stand out compared to the rest of the colors. And he holds that head up high and proud, doesn't he? Here you can see he really gets some air as he trots, which is very typical of an Arabian show horse. This location is in beautiful Rio Verde, which is just east of Scottsdale, Arizona. If you know anything about Arabian horses, you know that Scottsdale is a real mecca for Arabian horses, and each year is the Scottsdale Arabian Horse Show. That comes along every February, and I'll have tons of videos again from the Scottsdale Show, so keep an eye out for those. Right here, a little dog decides to make his presence known and uh, makes this boy jump, but uh, yeah, he says, don't get too close. And then of course the dog comes right back again, but this time on the outside of the fence. Well, that's it for our first horse, J. Savo GRK, but there's a lot to love about him. So please let me know in the comments what your favorite thing about him was. And now let's say hello to our next Arabian horse. She's a chestnut mare named Aria Zahara. She's a purebred Arabian, and she looks like she's a sister to the first horse, but they're actually not related at all. Her sire is E.S. Harir, and the dam is Katoria, and the breeder is Waldemar B.A.K., all the way from Karsu, Poland. She came here in vitro when her mom was pregnant with her. Here she is coming into your living room or off your phone as the case may be, but uh, we get a nice close look at her. You can see her uh, mane and tail aren't as long as the first horse, but her coat's a little darker shade of chestnut, so that makes for a great contrast with the uh, lighter color of her mane and tail. Plus this horse is younger than she looks. Uh, she was born around a year and a half before this video was made, so I'm guessing the mane and tail will grow a little bit longer as time goes on, but please let me know in the comments if you know anything about that. Nice look here in slow motion as she canters past us. And then she hits the brakes hard. Here you can see she does have some white markings on her face, but it's not really a blaze like the first horse had. She has a star up on her forehead, and then that little white down by the muzzle is called a snip. By the way, I said earlier she was a mare, which is what her registration papers say, but at her age, I just realized she's actually a filly. Mares are four years old and older. There you can see that arched neck that uh, is very classic Arabian horse. It's a very unique look that's not like any other horse I've ever seen. Now she just moves along so smoothly, doesn't she? I love watching horses that are good movers like this one is. While you're watching this beautiful filly, I wanna take just a few seconds to let you know I now have some really cool print products that you can order. 
You can even use your own images that I'll color correct and custom crop for you before uploading them. So you can take an image like this screenshot from this video and turn it into something like this. Pretty cool, huh? I'll leave a link in the description, but the site is simply MagnificentHorses.com. Here she breaks into a nice gallop and comes right toward me like she's going to run me over, but then fortunately thinks better of it. Just look at how beautiful that light mane is next to that dark chestnut body. Really cool looking. Here again, it looks like she's going to come right off the screen at you, but uh, then she gives me a look and moves away. I mentioned about four peaks earlier, and here's a great look at it in the background. So with the halter back on, Alaire's friend Elizabeth gives this filly a nice pat and takes her back to her stall. So that's a wrap for this video about these two amazing chestnut Arabian horses. And here's a link if you want to see that gray stallion I mentioned earlier in the video. Thanks.